Hey everybody, welcome back to Tech Odyssey. So today I'm here with the review of Incipio's new Esquire series case for the Samsung Galaxy S10. Now I'm actually a little confused with this one. They call it the Holden case, H-O-L-D-E-N, and I'll show you on my iPad here. Uh, it's called the Holden case, but this is the same pattern, same material, pretty much everything that the Esquire series has been. So I guess they're just throwing the Esquire tag onto this new Holden series case. Now, I have to say, I really have to try and stay impartial and objective whenever it comes to cases, but pretty much anything that has the Esquire series name attached to it and has this nylon woven fabric material on the case, it's just, it's, it's my favorite. And I'm not just partial because it's my job, but I love these cases. Let me go ahead and pop this open there. So, they really are great cases. And this one is thinner. And it's very form-fitting, and it just wraps around and hugs the phone. It's super nice. So, a little bit on the box here real quick. It's compatible with wireless charging. It's got a one-year warranty with it. And here we go. You can read the box. With a design that's like an extension of your everyday wardrobe, the slim holding case from our Esquire series is equal parts stylish and protective. So, the soft, sophisticated fabric on the exterior is durable and resistant to fraying, while the shock-absorbing shell and raised bezel provide all-around protection. Now, this one doesn't have a mill standard drop protection rating, which I'm a little disappointed with because all the other previous ones have. But, it feels like it's made out of polycarbonate with TPU bumpers on the sides. And it's got really, really good cutouts, so you can plug in probably pretty much whatever you want. And then, it's got this spray resistant nylon woven material on the back of the Incipio logo. I'm a huge, huge fan of this look. So let's go ahead and put the phone in there. See the phone pops right in there. It's nice and snug. You know, the sides do have a little bit of give to them, but they contour and they hold on to the phone well. Uh, this matte black finish on the sides looks really good. And then, of course, it's a little bit different because you've got these indentations. Instead of buttons that protrude, it has indentation openings here. So you can feel them. They're palpable whenever you press on the side and you can hear them. They click, they work just fine, but they don't stick out like normal buttons. So it's kind of a novel feature that they put in here and I like it. And the cameras stand out really, really well, especially with this recess cutout that you have here. So you get great protection for your three camera setup and your biometric sensor on the back. You can place it down with ease. You don't have to worry about anything, especially if you want to wirelessly charge it. So you've got that going for you as well. And then on the front, you have the enhanced bezel on the top and the bottom. So here, see how it's raised up there, and it's also raised up down here on the bottom. So what that does is it gives you that extra level of protection. If you place your phone down on a flat surface, you don't have to worry about scratching up the screen which is super important with the Galaxy S10 and S10 Plus series because, well, screen protectors just aren't a whole lot of them floating around, especially the glass ones because of the ultrasonic fingerprint sensor built into the screen. But overall, uh, I really like this case. I like that it's not bulky. It fits the phone really well. It's just, it's like an extension of the phone. And it's a great compliment because I don't like when the cases obscure the form factor. I buy a phone for a reason and I get used to it. I like it. And then it's like, oh, here, let me throw this case on here. Nope, doesn't feel like an S10 anymore. So, like I said, down on the bottom, you can see that it's got great big openings there. So you can get to the USB-C connector, also to the headphone jack, and then you've got the speaker over there and the microphone cut out as well. I mean, the engineering, the craftsmanship, the, precision, the precision on this case are fantastic, along with the aesthetics. I absolutely love it. Now, one thing you're going to have to be careful this nylon fabric on the back is really slicker. I mean, it's really slippery. So if you place it on something, it'll slide around. So be careful with that. But the TPU sides on it actually have pretty decent grip. And since it doesn't make the phone fatter than it naturally already is, which I mean, it really is, it's pretty thin, it still allows you to have a nice grip on it. So I don't think you're going to drop it when it's in your hand, but be careful with it sliding around if you place it down on its back. Now, also, uh, I did read a comment someone had left with regard to the case that the white stone, white, white dome, the super popular screen protector that people have been using will just barely fit on here. Uh, I'm going to put a armor suit on here this weekend, but the regular screen protector, as long as, yeah, it should fit. 
no problem. I mean, the one that's on here already works. And then I've also put uh, a Skinomi on my S10 Plus and it's compatible with cases as well. So this should be A-OK -okay for pretty much any screen protector that you need to put on here. Uh, just as a public service announcement, be wary of any of the glass ones. If you look on Amazon, make sure you check out the, uh, the ratings for them and look at recent relevant ratings because you'll find that there'll be ratings for the screen protector before the phone even comes out. So pay attention for fake Amazon reviews. That's just a public service announcement. But back to the video on the Holden Series Esquire case. I love it. It's a fantastic case. And I don't think you're going to be disappointed if you go and pick one up. Now, if you want to pick one up, it's only available in this gray color. It's $34.99, so it is a little bit more on the pricey side, but it's something that should hold up for a while. You get the one-year warranty, and really, I mean, look at it. It looks great. So that's all I've got uh, for the Incipio Holden Esquire Series case for the Samsung Galaxy S10. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them down in the comment section. I will get back with you, and as always, I'll see you guys next time.